Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. JavaScript labels are used to provide a statement with an identifier that you can then use a break or continue statement on. To label a statement in JavaScript, you precede the statement with the name of the label you choose followed by a colon. A label in JavaScript can be any identifier that is not a reserved word. A list of JavaScript reserved words is contained in the appendix section of the instruction manual. The break statement with a label reference can be used to jump out of any block of code. Without a label reference, the break statement can only be used inside of a loop or switch. The continue statement, with or without a label, can only be used inside a loop. The basic syntax for a label is label, colon statement, where label is whatever word you choose for the name of the label. The following sample code creates a label called list and uses a break statement to jump out of the code after the first three items in the array. So, we start with the body tag. Paragraph tag with an ID equal to car demo in quotes, the closed paragraph tag, and the closed body tag. The open script tag, cars equals bracket Chrysler in quotes, comma Mercedes in quotes, comma Toyota in quotes, comma Mazda in quotes, comma Ford in quotes, close brackets, and the semicolon. Text equals open and close quotes followed by a semicolon. List colon, that's our label. Left curly bracket text plus equals cars bracket zero close bracket plus quote line break tag end quote semicolon text plus equals cars bracket one close bracket plus quote line break tag end quote semicolon text plus equals cars bracket two close bracket plus quote line break tag close quote semicolon break list semicolon text plus equals cars bracket three close bracket plus quote line break tag close quote semicolon text plus equals cars bracket four close bracket plus quote line break tag close quote semicolon close curly bracket document dot get element by ID quote car demo close quote parentheses dot inner HTML equals text semicolon and the close script tag. After the code has been executed the browser will display Chrysler, Mercedes, and Toyota and will break the list there because we only need listed the first three vehicles. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.